This is the plane that two Polk State College students will be flying in for over 24 hours next week. They say more women should be getting behind the wheel. The person in control of this plane is 20 years old, a Polk State College student and a female. The longest flight I've done is 7.7 .7 hours. Autumn Rashars flew to Georgia Friday morning to pick up a rescue pup. And next week, she and fellow student Emma Othmer will be competing in the 45th annual Women's Air Race Classic. Make sure that leading edge is slick. The days long all female race requires pilots to fly by airports in 10 states, calculating navigation, maintenance and fuel needs along the way. Each year, the race takes off from a different city. This year, it begins in Lakeland and ends in Terre Haute, Indiana. I think this air race um, is a great opportunity to show women pilots of all ages and hopefully more people will be inspired to become pilots through this. The aircraft doesn't know who's flying it, so they don't know if you're male or female. Rochelle Floyd is a commercial pilot and has been flying for over two decades. I get skipped over because I'm a female and um, I'm called Richard a lot because I think people just expect to be speaking to a male. But at the Air Race Classic, her first, she will be just another one of the ladies. I'm really excited about the experience for one, but just the camaraderie between all of the teams and meeting the women. The 45th annual Women's Air Race Classic takes off Tuesday morning right here at Lakeland Linder Airport. Reporting in Lakeland, I'm Stacey DeSilva, 8 on your side.